Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Daddy Delicious Show. It's the greatest show on earth, and today we are in Taos. And uh, what we are doing is we are going to go take a look at what they got to eat and drink and whatever else they got going on over here. So come on with me on the journey, and let's get it done. Let's go. Daddy Delicious. We're at the Village Chocolates here. Right here, we're outside. We're about to go in. We're about to see what kind of delicious treats they have. Let's so come with us. Oh, it smells good in here. It smells delicious. Lots of chocolate. Oh, Michigan maple syrup. Look at this jawbreaker, bro. Look at that jawbreaker. It's huge. Oh, you, Mark, I'm trying to do a interview. You're catching her in motion, right? I mean, oh, yeah, I guess. She is. All right, all right. That's good. Look how professional. She is professional. What's the best thing here? The fruit. What kind of fruit? What's the, what's the best fruit? I like the raspberries or the pineapple. I'm going to get the raspberries and the pineapple then. Okay. My name is Kyle. And uh, they, on YouTube, I'm Daddy Delicious. Okay. So, all right. So, how long have you owned this place? Uh, this is our ninth year. Okay. My husband and I. Okay, you live in the area, I, I'm yep, assuming? Yeah, we live in Tawas, absolutely. Okay, all right. And uh, what made you get a, a chocolate place, like a candy store? Why not? That's a good answer. I like that. Everyone likes candy, exactly. right? Exactly. We said, so, why not? We'll give it a try. If not, we can go back to office jobs. Right, we sure. We never have. Right. App, that's awesome. Living the dream, huh? Yeah. So this is a great... I've never been to Taos before. Really? Yeah, it's my first time. I've lived in Michigan all my life. Nobody... We're so. the... Uh, don't tell anyone about Lake Huron. Okay. Don't listen. <laughs> no, it's none of you know... It's part of Michigan. No one yeah, knows about. Don't come up here. But if you do come up here... Yeah. Then come to this candy store Thank and get you. some candy. Yeah. What's the name of this candy store? The uh, Village Chocolatier. The Village Chocolatier. And we okay. are the sunrise side of the state. Okay. Because we get the sunrise. It's beautiful out here. I love it out here. I love Thanks. it out here. Yeah. It's okay. our favorite place. That, and you're making, what are you making over there? Those look like the blueberries? We do fresh dip raspberries, blueberries, pineapple, and caramel apple wedges every day. I just I just got a bunch of it. So I'm going to go outside. <laughs> I'm going to get some diabetes <laughs> along, with my, along with my fresh fruit intake. No, so. well, we have sugar free, so don't worry. Oh, oh, look. Okay. All right. Excellent. All right. Well, thank you very much, Jasmine. Well, thanks for stopping I, in. Yep, I, I hope you have a good trip around yeah, here. Yeah. Yeah. We'll be back next year. So I'll see you next year. All right. So, absolutely. All right, fist bump. Thank you very Thanks. much. See ya. First thing we got going on here, chocolate covered cherries. What's up? <laughs> mm, Mark, crispy. Oh my God, those are good. Pineapple, right here, pineapple. So good. Like this is either blueberry or raspberry. It's a raspberry. Oh my God. What's going on? Blueberry. You know, I'm gonna be honest with you. I thought it was just gonna be like, yeah, fruit's okay, and it's just chocolate fruit, whatever. That that is either really fresh fruit or the chalk, this kind of chocolate they just did something to them. I mean that was I mean, grab a pineapple chunk. Right? Right? God. Village Chocolatier, downtown Towers. Oh my God. Oh my God. Caught. Come here. What? You, now what? You, what's going on? Oh, I don't know what to get. What? You hungry? Yeah. What do you, what do you want to eat? I want McDonald's. You want McDonald's? Yeah. You should we do a day delicious review at McDonald's? Yeah. No, we shouldn't. Yeah, we should. We're in a different town. There's a bunch of unique restaurants. What do you want? What do you want to get at McDonald's? Oh, some like. Chicken tenders? Oh, McNuggets. Nuggets? Yeah, McNuggets. McNuggets. You are, you are a McNugget, Danny. <laughs> All right, here's the deal, ladies and gentlemen. We just stopped at a place called the Buckhorn. We were gonna eat in downtown Taos, and then, and then we were driving and we saw this place. Mark, um, <laughs> the place looks seedy as <laughs> hell. Uh, it looks a little sketchy, but you know, looking at the reviews, we just happened to drive upon it. And I mean, I, I have not seen a bad review. All right. So the only bad review that was a one star was just based on the fact that this was probably during the height of COVID, and they said, "Yeah, don't come because they're not serving." But every review, the food is good, it's affordable, and they're very friendly. All right, we're gonna try this out. Let's. Uh, Kyle, look at this. Let's, uh, right, five star, right five star, five star, five star, five star. We're, we're gonna check it out. Let's see where the Buckhorn Inn, baby. Let's, go to the Let's do this. Buckhorn Inn, spirits, beer, wine, casual dining, banquet room, and catering. You know what? Sometimes the small little joints like this are the best. Hello. So this place has been around since the 1930s. So since the Prohibition era. It's the oldest restaurant bar operating Taos. 
All right, they're, they're fresh out of the fryer. Let's see, Mark, you're gonna have to have one too with the. Enjoy it, buddy. We got the, we got the sea owls right here. The what kind of sauce you got there? I don't know. It's supposed to be some kind of sweet and sour kind of a deal. This thing is melting, face melting hot. So I gotta. Go for in your tongue, man. I'll try not to. Oh man, this is hot. I can feel it. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Ooh, this is gonna hurt. Mm, that's good. I don't like that sauce, but the crab ragoon is good. It has the, the cream and cheese inside of it. the flavor on the sauce. Yeah, I'm not the sauce. Oh, good. I wasn't expecting to have, come to this restaurant and get a Chinese dish. No, well, neither was I. It was good. It was good. I like it. Check this out. Wow, look at yours. Mark, that looks good. Uh, look at this. Fantastic. This has mushrooms and onion and oh, Mark, look at yours. You got a cheeseburger slider thing. I got the sliders. Wow. I got the crispy fries. That looks great. Mmm. Hot, crispy. Right out of the hoop fryer. We got to get it all on here. Can't let any of this go to waste. All right, here we go. Here we go. The inside of the bun's all toasted. <laughs> that steak has a lot of flavor. Yeah, that's delicious. Look. The bread. The bread is like crispy on the inside. Really, I mean, it really toasted that thing. And it's good. It goes great like this. So when you're out traveling, doing different stuff, just stop in it right We didn't even know this place was here. We're driving by and, and Mark, we're gonna go, gonna go somewhere else. And Mark says, or oh, we could just go right here. And I just pulled in the parking lot. And now here we are. I'm glad we did it. How's, how's your, oh, let me get a video on you. How was it, Mark? Delicious. Let me see, let me, let me see the inside of that thing. So there's bacon on there and there's oh. cheese. It's good, huh? It's delicious. Perfectly cooked. Mm. Very good burger. That's why I call him Mission Gangsta. <laughs> These onion rings are perfect. Crispy. Right. Right for sure. We're done right. They know what they're doing here. This is the oldest restaurant in Tawas. 1930, you said? Yeah. Then it burned down. Then it burned down in the 60s. And they rebuilt immediately. We've been here forever, you know? We accept the meat sweats on the Daily Delicious channel. We embrace the meat sweats. Sometimes we even want the meat sweats. You know you had a good meal when you had the meat when you get the meat sweats. Oh look, oh all this melty. Mm, gooey. Delicious eat. Mm. The cheese is all melted and creamy inside of here. I love places like this, man. Well, I drive from Detroit to here. I wouldn't drive that far for a lot of food. However, However, if you want to see the Great Lakes, Lake Huron, and visit the town of Tawas, I would definitely say come here. Probably wouldn't drive two and a half hours okay. for this, but <coughs> if I was already here on the way through, I would definitely stop in here. If I had to put it on one to ten, put like seven and a half. Okay. Okay. But you gotta remember, five is average. Yep. Anything that's a five is like average. It's, it's, it's okay. It's cookie, fine. It's, it's pretty Absolutely. neutral. So anything above a five, <coughs> anything above a five is you're doing good. Oh. Into the sunlight. Oh man. All right. Listen. Listen. Listen, people. Listen, Linda. Listen, Linda. Listen. That was, this guy's going for it. This guy's going for it. Look at him, get it. Get it, Russell Bourbon. Listen, Mark, that was great. Yeah. You drive by this place and look at it and you're just like, ah, it's a, I don't even wanna go there. Look, I mean, look at the sign. It could use some work. It honestly could use a little refreshing, but the food speaks for itself, right? They didn't have tater tots, but the rest of it was really good. He really wants some effing tater tots, man. They didn't have the whole time we were in there, he kept, 
Where's the tater? I want tater tots. And he even said, what did you say they should do here? They should make a loaded tater tot dish and call it the mark. The that mark. Sell. It'll I mean, sell. It, it sell. You, that, I think it completely sell. Would you put bacon on that? A little bit of bacon, some scallions, some jalapenos, some cheese, some chili, a little bit of sour cream. I'd buy it. Of course you would. I'd eat mark. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Let's go. <laughs> that was good. The, uh, the buckhorn in. So to all my day delicious crew, I love you. Coming straight at you from Cowboys, Michigan. And I'll talk to you people later. Peace.